Well, hello there. Welcome to their mail day video here from Body Hunter Breaks. This is Boba Fett Me. And yeah, I've just got a few packages here. One from Tops, CSB, Titan cards. Looks like I've got a redemption fulfillment from Upper Deck. Looks like three different ones from the outside of the package. And then I have some artwork that I had commissioned from an artist for a Star Wars artist. The Jerry Garcia. So yeah, so we're going to jump right into it here. As I say, not a lot, but enough to warrant a mail, quick mail day video. So yeah, this one here should be another top living set for the Star Wars. If I can get it to open. Again, they've been doing a good job of keeping on top of them. I think they're only two weeks behind on shipments. So I think this is probably 29 and 30 or maybe 31 and 32. But we'll see. Let me say... Oh, yes. <laughs> 29 and 30. Get size noodles. Oh, jeez. Yep. And GA97. A droid from Force Awakens. It looks like he has an old microphone for his mouthpiece. But. Look at the size noodles, those lips. Woo hoo! So 29 and 30. I'm still waiting for my next Alex Party, the, the Tatis Predator. I have not received mine yet. It just shipped, I want to say, a week ago. So I hope that's good information and that means I'm getting a, a parallel so we'll do Titan next this one here I really when I finally opened up my one package there from them and it had the vintage onyx vintage I was like ah let me get a couple more so I can't remember if it was just two boxes or three boxes it might have been three looks like here's all the base cards so we have Ed Howard Jason Dominguez base Celestin Reese Hines Eddie Yeen and Yarlin Susana Susana So that's the base cards from that. And then uh, and Alexander Mojica. There's blue ink. Or Carlos Comanares for Tampa Bay. I wonder how young he is. 2003, 18. Morelvis Martinez for the Blue Jays. He's 20 years old. A redemption for Francisco Alvarez. A Yohan Adon for the Nationals. And I'm going to have to send that one in. And then probably the hit of the three boxes was the Jason Dominguez autograph. So again, since it's blue, it's Upwards of 325, could be less, but it's not hand numbered, so. So that concludes that. Then we'll do the up, nah, yeah, we'll do the upper deck next.
It looks like the Redemptions for Artifacts. We got a Dylan Coughlin for the Golden Knights, $195 and $999. A Cal Foot, $137 of $999. And a Artem Zagadulin for the Flames, $96 of $999. There's those rookies. Uh, we'll do the CSB. I can't remember what this break was for now. I think it was for Elements. Football, I jumped in. It was, like, say, pick your team. And I went for Seahawks and... Lions because I was hoping for a Barry Sanders. But so two were hitless, so it looks like I got some National Baseball Card Day hitless packs. And here we go for the Seahawks. We got a Dwayne Eskridge gold. Okay, 84 of 99. And then a Team Chemistry, Russell Wilson, DK Metcalf, and Dwayne Eskridge. And that's 3 of 75, so it's uh, Russell Wilson's jersey number. And then for the, Cha uh, for the Lions... Oh, goodness gracious. Why can't I get my finger underneath that? Jeez. <clears throat> Looks like a single card in that for the Lions. A supercharged Amon St. Brown. Amon Ra St. Brown, 136 of 199. Single color jersey card. And then the last, Seahawks. So it was in the other break for Seahawks. It was a DK Metcalf, a 161 of 250. Oh, yeah, and that one has the, the coating <laughs> already starting to peel off on the back. It's lovely. I noticed that on some of the packs that the, the coating actually got stuck to the inside of the pack. So we're going to do these two hitless National Baseball Card Day packs. See if anything good comes out of them. I'm not expecting anything exciting, but who can tell? Ugh. So we got a Ketel Marte. Starting off, then Whit Merrifield, Kyle Lewis, Juan Soto, Ryan Mountcastle. So I got one rookie in that pack. Next pack with Aaron Judge on the front. Frickin' Yankees going on a super duper win streak although I think they lost last night to the, the Oakland A's. So it starts off with an Aaron Judge, Xander Bogarts, Alex Bregman, Tatis, and a Vlad. So no no autographs out of those two packs. Well, we're down to the last item here. I have not, I didn't cut the, the back here, so it's probably going to be a pain in the butt to get this open. Come on. 
Now let's see what happens. See if I can get it to tear or not. Probably not because of all this tape. So yeah, I kind of took advantage when I saw that the artist was offering up to do custom. It was to a museum collection blank. And uh, took advantage of it, the opportunity. So there's his business card. He mostly does Star Wars, but he also does baseball and some football, looks like. I think he's from Illinois, so not surprising he'd do like Khalil Mack, Walter Payton. So yeah, you probably already saw it, but a nice Ted Williams. And it's official art card, so he had some leftover blanks. Yeah, nice Ted Williams. That'll go really nice with uh, this one of one from Project 2020 last year. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this mail day video. Oh, and the boop ego fly even away. I'll have to see if I've got any one touches that would fit that. But uh, for now, just sleeve it up and put it in a put it in a top loader. Uh, slice a Yeah, great work, and it is the only one of its kind. So, yeah. and that, as I say, that concludes this mail day video. Appreciate taking the time to watch it, and as always, keep collecting.